Okay, we're going live, babe. Going live. Press the button. We might be live right now. We don't know until we see it on our side. Babe, don't make that face. Babe. Babe. Don't make that face. I thought it would be entertaining to the people who are waiting for the show. Hopefully start. they didn't see that. <sighs> Do I look like a fish? You're stepping on my my earbud. Can I have a kiss? No, not like that. <laughs> We're not live yet. We're live! Oh, yeah, you we guys are. missed me making my epic fish face! Hopefully. Oh, babe, babe, stop, stop. I'm going to play the intro. I saw you getting your face ready. <laughs> I will play the intro. Babe! <laughs> Why do you hate that? Babe, the beaches don't want to see that. I think I really look like a fish. <laughs> if I was in a tank. <laughs> Would you scuba dive Welcome to me? episode Hi, 154, welcome. guys. Is there a story behind the cat mouth thing? It's popping cat. Yep. Popping cat. That's all. Fishy, fishy. So, everybody. Welcome in beaches. It's how you work, uh, work out your jaw. Get it's ready how you warm up your jaw for tight muscles right here so that you look thin all the time. Thin. Yeah. Thin, all just right. like me. So, so we're going to talk about our next cruise coming up. We've got, a, prom we've got a premiere tonight. Uh, the show is going to the dogs. The show is gone to the fishes. Uh, premiere tonight, bar crawl, but babe. <laughs> the bar crawl, baby, and we do it in a really fun way that we've never done before, and it was a good time. And it's pie day, so we're going to talk about pizza. It's pie day! 
314. And were you affected by Ben and David? I wasn't. I didn't if know. You are. Time. Compensation may be headed your way. Guess what? I want to know something. In honor of Pi Day, as we're going to say hello to everybody, I don't care if you're affected by Ben and David right now. I want to know what's your favorite pizza toppings? Pizza time. What's your favorite? That was <laughs> such a good setup. Was that? Ba I'm basically Brett and Cindy segueing in. Yeah, look at that. Mm -hmm. Oh, 669. Six, end pull. End pull. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're a loser. 69% say Pizzeria del Capitano. Oh, they've never obviously eaten at Sorrento's. Gilbs are right. The yeah. Gilbs are right. Pepperoni mushroom. Mark McClure, you like mushrooms? What? What? We it's should have put mushroom in this. How does he like mushrooms? I don't understand how you like mushrooms, Mark. Okay, well, hello to Mark from Mark, the Cruise Mark, welcome in, buddy. Mark uh, and Stephanie are at the very end of our new vlog that's very coming Very end. Oh, it's all you know the, what? It's all the time slots they paid for. I got to do something real quick, babe. Babe, babe, babe. I'll, okay. I'll do it over here. I'm gonna, I was reading the chat. Ah! I can't read the chat at all because you took away all the chat screen. Um, um, I got to go to this, and then I just, oh, it's still disabled anyway. Okay, okay no Mike. Worries. Okay. Mushroom black olive your mom likes. I like pepperoni mushroom black olive. Amanda mm -hmm. Roman likes a Philly cheesesteak pizza with added banana peps. Carl Roman likes pepperoni and pineapple. Pepsh. Tess Almon likes sausage Canadian bacon. Lots of Mark good mozzarella. Mark likes it in the app. It's proof. Here. <laughs> Who said that? Mark. He said he I likes... like it in the end or the aft. So oh. maybe he is sad he didn't get that I take it in the aft. I mean, well, I like it in the aft. He shouldn't shirt. have said he can't wear it then. Mike's pissed at you, Mark. He didn't even read your message. I thought he would like the other shirt. He, I know. He, he does, does like back-to-back -back cruising. Carla McLennan He said it looks sausage. like it's from the 80s, and I don't know if he notices it's like Back to the Future. Yeah, it's like the Back to the Future. Um... BLT pizza, bacon, lettuce, cheese, and, and mayo. Mayo on a pizza? Take his wrench. Black olives, says Tom Beetle Bailey. I like some B.O.'s. Um, also taco pizza is good. White sauce is good. Now I like, uh, Meg says salami, banana peppers, feta, and artichoke. That sounds like a bad breath. That sounds spice. like your, but, but I love that. Whenever we get, um, pizza from Domino's, I get a thin crust with salami, um, spinach, and feta. Okay. It's bomb. The salami and the feta is great together. Uh, dessert okay. pizza, apple or raspberry or Poor strawberry. Poor crazy cat I like traveler. That, Billy J. You can keep your wrench. No, well that's fine because you didn't put mayo on that. Okay. Poor crazy cat traveler says I would like my mean spirited doctor to let me have dairy again so I can enjoy real pizza. Meg, give crazy cat traveler's doctor one point. <laughs> We're pissed one at him. Point. Uh, Ryan says, if, if I, was I was affected, affected by, by ben, ben and David, should I call McAllister McAllister? Yes. <laughs> That's exactly correct, Ryan. McAllister, 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 cruise attorneys at law. Uh, Med also likes Cruise attorneys for cruising, right? Pepperoni and mushroom is great. Yeah. Med, you like mushrooms too? Crazy Cat Traveler Doctor, one. Breakfast pizza is cool too. I like breakfast pizza. Uh, we got a Supreme with green olives from Paul. Uh, garlic chicken pizza from Cheryl. One deck down. Finding me. Oh, Finding Miriam says sliced pears, fig jam, bacon, and feta. That sounds like it would be at our work. Okay, taco pizza. Pet yum. sausage, black Love. olive, and onion. Yum, OG. Yum. That's just missing mushrooms. I I, I love a taco pizza too. Remember the the what was it called when we made it? Taco pizza? The fiesta. Oh, the fiesta. The fiesta. Remember when we had to make mm. fajita meat, fajita meat, fajita. Fajita. That's what the one guy I'm would thirsty. say. Thirsty. I'm gonna crack open. Today I have uh, cherry. Cherry Clearly. as well. There it is. Uh, we will do cocktail corner in a minute, guys. But first, you know what? Cocktail I gotta... corner is weird. Yum. I heard Ben and David are starting to make their own ice cream now. Their own, they start their own company in competition with Ben and Gary. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's Jerry. That's okay. Um, <clears throat> I have, I love green olive on a pizza. Meg, you and my mom. I like green olive now because that's all my mom would always order. What would she order from Pizza Factory? 
nasty green olives. Pepperoni and green <laughs> deli olives that literally smelled like a dirty vagina. Mmm, charcuterie board on a mm, pizza. At finding, finding Miriam. Miriam. Hey, welcome in Finding Miriam, by the no way. No pizza for Ben and David. That's right, Anthony Simone. WPB! Michelle, WPB. <clears throat> Not that late. Uh, Travel Adventures with Eric B. said a hello to absolutely everyone. Peace! I'm a bacon and pineapple Positive pizza vibes here. guy. It's far superior than Canadian bacon. I like Canadian bacon. Yeah, what do you Canadian got against the Canadians? Canadian bacon, pineapple, bacon, and cashew. Good. How about that? Aaron Smith says, hello, beaches. Looking forward what to an intellectual, uh... intellectually stimulating show. That's what Friday. Beach Please is known for, being intellectually stimulating, right? Mm -hmm. We're so smart. <laughs> Hey. Don't I look like a fish oh. when I do that? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> I really okay. want you to give me a kiss. Pineapple does not belong on a pizza. Carla, sit down, Carla. How happy are yeah. we that Jason's back? Come on. He's barely even saying any words, and he's already doing better acting than half the, <laughs> half the, half the actors. Hello, everybody. Ten minutes of pizza toppings. LOL. At Beach, please. Understood. Traveling Gilbert said move on. Okay, let's find uh, Brett and Cindy then. <laughs> I love a moderator that's keeping us in check. All right, segue These on muscles. to the next part. We've got... Uh, Cocktail Corner. Cocktail Corner. We, yeah, we kind of helloed to everybody. Not really everyone. If we didn't say hello to you, then uh, let's just throw this <laughs> Crazy in Crazy Cat Traveler said Mike reacts to Betsy's hello. fish face the way Betsy reacts to any hot challenge. Hi. <laughs> Paul Vine says pizza's passion, Gil. What's up? All right. Oh, Danny D was doing the cat thing. Okay, let's let's go on to Cocktail Corner. Let's see. Where is the intro for it? There it is. I might do it all night. Just Welcome to Betsy's Cocktail Corner, where today we're going to be making a pizza cocktail. This morning, Mike told me it was pie day, and he's looking up all these pizza pictures, and I said, look up right now if there's a pizza cocktail. Turns out, these are the ingredients for a pizza cocktail. Vodka, Italian seasoning turned into a simple syrup, pepper, salt, tomatoes. My Bacardi shaker tank. We're gonna take some tomatoes. We got some different colors of tomato here, different flavors. I'm gonna throw them in. That looks good to me. Model up so we can get some of those juice. Juice. <laughs> Juices. Next, we're gonna crack open the vodka. Okay, two ounces of vodka. And then, this really cool simple syrup. Sugar, hot water, and Italian seasoning. Huh. I got a little advice from Diana. She said I need to let the flavors marry each other. And I said, do you think you're ready for that type of a commitment? Mm. Anyways, we're going to take this Italian seasoning simple syrup. Smell it. That's good. We're gonna hit it with a little bit of salt. This is a shaky salt shaker, so you gotta be careful. That seems good, don't you think? Okay, he's not answering. And we're gonna pepper grind in some pepper. A little bit of more pepper is always good. Gonna chuck in some ice. Get the shaker turn rudder and shake it up. Should I shake it like my mom? This is icy. Can she do it? That's what you're also thinking. Do you feel impressed, Juice Boy? Gonna need a little tiny glass. <gasps> I forgot basil! Get out this ice ball! No, no, that's not I... How do you do it? Squeeze it. Oh, that's easier. Hmm. Put your ice ball in. And now, we're gonna double strain this because of the tomatoes, man. 
You see those seeds? That's why you gotta double strain, Beaches. And here we have, oop, I didn't strain good enough. Got some Italian sparkles in there. Anyways, cheers, Beaches. This tastes like a pizza with a hint of vodka. Vodka sauce pizza. Cheers, Beaches. Updates. Cheers, Beaches. Update, Mike had a great idea. Why don't we infuse the vodka with pepperoni? It will really taste like pizza then. It tasted good before. Now it's... Tastes like a frozen pizza that's still frozen. It really tastes like pepperoni <laughs> now. It tastes like a it frozen like pe that... pizza that's still frozen. Taste it and think of that. It really tastes like pizza, it but not in a good way. Legitimately <laughs> like pizza. Oh, gosh. Well, it's going to happen. Okay. Italian sparkle. Okay, well, you guys had some pretty funny comments. Needs a pep garnish. Strain because we just want the tomato juice. Cock meat tail. Needs Parmesan cheese rim. <laughs> yes, Renee said all of that's right. still frozen. Should we get some parm? That would have been funny to do a parm rim. Ah, yeah. Mm. It's disgusting. pizza in the morning, pizza in the evening, pizza, pizza in not in your cocktail. I think I'm gonna have that as bad burps. When pizza's in a cocktail, you should not have pizza in a cocktail, <laughs> especially if it's got pepperoni. There she fun. is. Pizza in the morning, <laughs> pizza in the evening, pizza at supper time. When pizza's in a cocktail, you can pizza anytime. Thanks, were you already Tanya. typing that, Tanya? When I started singing it, I hope you were. I was laughing so hard when you guys were singing that in the hot air balloon we were singing it at, at vienza oh that's okay I, coming out of the elevator i think then mm. how about Gosh, pizza and a cocktail pizza, next time pepperoni i'm with you meg i'll All just right. have a rum and coke please carla said <laughs> <laughs> that's funny uh, yes how did you know because you typed Cause, fast cause, yeah all right Love uh, if you guys want to drink with us maybe not a pizza cocktail but we are going to be cruising on carnival a wonderful Carnival for Renze. The non-inaugural cruise May 2nd through 7th. 2024. Coming That's right. In 49, 49 days. days. Sailing out of Long Beach to Cabo San Lucas and Ensenada. What are we doing in Cabo San Lucas, babe? Scuba diving with Ryan Donahue. And then? We're going to do a bar crawl. Well, we're probably going to have a big-ass beer after scuba diving. We're then we're going to do, do a nighttime, because look, it, Star Wars happens at night. Bar crawl. <laughs> Does it really? Yeah. It's because they're in space, Because you got to see the stars. Oh, uh, I see so where you You can't have there. a war without stars, Mike. Duh. Oh, okay. It's freaking rocking science, bro. All right. Well, Anyways, we're 18 minutes in. So we're going to be doing a bar crawl with the beaches, and maybe you, if you want to join us. And give we will me a not call. be doing... Pizza cocktails, even though it's an Italian themed ship. Woo woo. Okay. And we will be having a toga party. And there is the. Uh, that is the. Toga. Toga. Toga, 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 toga party toga. statue made for us by the lovely <laughs> Todd Blount. Poop da Cano. Oh, a guy man. came into work yesterday wearing a Punta Cana hat. Guess did what? Really? Yeah, did he really? I Punta cana Yeah. Well, uh, if you guys can't make it on the Carnival Ferenze, we are having Ferenze. our own group cruise on the Carnival Jubilee next year. 2025. Not this year, but uh, October 25th of 2025, not That's 2024. Right. Out of Galveston to Roatan, Costa, Costa Maya, Maya and, and Cozumel. But if you guys do feel like, you know, I can't wait that long to uh, Halloween cruise. Mike, Betsy, I, I can't wait for two years. Well, guess what, Beaches? You're in luck because the Cruise World Group Booze Cruise is this year. Yes. October 27, 2024, and you got it. The same exact freaking ports. Yeah. But, but from Miami. From Miami. That's exactly what I was going to say. Yeah, and you can book All you have through to do. Stephanie McClure. Or Betsy or, Rodriguez, or Betsy either Hall. one. Yeah. It's all the same. It's all the same cruise. Come hang out with us. Let's have a blasty blast and uh, cruise this year and next year. Right. And if you haven't got your Carnival Forense shirt yet, you're in luck. Call Betsy 
now. Okay, wait. Wait until after the show, Mark says. Call Stephanie now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so there is, uh, how many people? I think it said seven people have this in their cart. Pull the trigger, guys. Pull. Because they the- are. <laughs> Flying, flying off the shelves. Off the Those shelves. Pam and calendars, they went quick. They're gone. They're sold out. Yeah. Carnival Firenze, non-agral. Crociera, Italiano. Italiana. Mark, you should probably get a shirt for, oh, except it says non agural Never mind, Mark. Don't get that shirt. And if... Uh, May the fourth be with you. Yeah, if you don't want to wear a costume. With the beaches. There's your pub crawl shirt right there. I ordered myself that shirt. Did you? I still need to order mine. And tonight we are doing a pizza game through Kahoot. The winner will choose between these shirts here. You get yourself a, shh, no one needs to know, pineapple on pizza shirt. That, or, that shirt gets a lot of comments, by the way. People love it. Or you get this one. Fresh late night pizza, all you can eat. He's cute. He's got a beer. You like him? He's got He's a beer. He's cute. I like him. I wonder if he tastes like this cocktail. <laughs> he probably frozen. does. Probably does. We'll have to look at the 2025 because I already have three remaining this year. Oh, that sounds actually, great. Actually, 12 people have it in their car. <gasps> Guys, good evening. Beer, Meg says. What? Three months into the year and the calendar's already sold out? <laughs> Shocking, right? Yep. Shocking. Pam is, is filthy rich so right now. so disgusting. You want to just, just down the whole thing? You actually put tomato in yours? I put, that was my garnish. It was a, one half of a tomato. <laughs> <laughs> really? Really? <laughs> Really selling it for me there, buddy. <laughs> oh, I'm salivating. Cruise Light TV wants to taste the cocktail. What you're going to do is if you have a frozen pizza in your <laughs> freezer. Just throw it in a blender with vodka. Throw it in a blender <laughs> with vodka. <laughs> and you could have the uh, smoothie uh, version. The oh, jack- God, that was so good. <laughs> so gross. Why? Yeah. It was good. It was mm. actually good before we infused the vodka with pepperoni. Thank you, Traveling Gilbs, telling everybody to uh, put the thumbs up. Let's all warm up our thumbs right now. I can't. That taste is so bad. It was better without the pepperoni flavor. Tom says he can see the spice floating in the bottom. It was way better without the pepperoni Ooh, flavor. You felt the heat come out of your breath right then. <laughs> it was a pepperoni heat. Okay. I have a Pam the calendar now. I need to put more stuff on it. Like maybe a cruise in October 27, 2024. Meg? All right, Mike, so guys. Sorry I laughed so hard just now. <laughs> Don't be sorry. That's what we're here for. This is an intellectually no. stimulating show. <laughs> I really did gag. Um. Oh, that's so funny. Frozen pizza in a blender with vodka. <laughs> Sounds like a drunk 4 a.m. concoction. concoction. Yeah. Unless you're high. That might be a better one. WPB. All okay. right. Let's, where's the segue? Where is the segue, babe? I can't find it. I don't know. It. Brett and Cindy, where are you? Uh, I can't oh, find it. Oh, it's right there. Oh, no. under pe- oh, no. oh, they're dropping like flies. <laughs> There it is, okay. Popping cat, please, please, please. Thank you, Cruise Light TV. Let's do a popping cat. Okay. Thank you, thank you, thank, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Boop, 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 boop. Just quit your job, Meg. Paul will support you. <coughs> Pizza's coming back up. Hi, Charlie Grace. Oh. Oh, we're done. Okay, we're done. We're done. We're done. Um, hello, everybody. And I don't know, do we say hi to the OGs? Hi, OGs. Hello, OGs. Hello, beautiful Donna. Hello. Ooh, you're not going to piss her off that way. Do you, how do you feel about chugging my drink? Uh, you, do you want me to chug your drink? No, I'll take some down in a minute. All right. That's what I thought, babe. All right, where's the segue? Where is the segue? Okay, let's not worry about it. We're going to go into the next topic. Matt says I do popping cat. Mike, why do you gotta do that? Sorry, I can't help Matt it. Matt says I do I've... popping cat way better than the cat. Duh, because I yap this jaw all day long. I have rheumatoid arthritis. I you do not have rheumatoid arthritis. <clears throat> I just burped like a little pizza taste. Okay, um, so we've all heard about the, the Ben and David controversy. They were on MSC World Europa and got told they cannot <gasps> film. Them. I'm tired of this story. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay. If you're not having fun on my cruise, get the f*** out. That's right. That's what, that's what they're saying. Yeah. Car- careful, Mike. Don't want him to lose it and go Super Saiyan. Oh, that's Betsy to that's go Super me. Saiyan. 
rage rage yeah. meter. Rage My roots meter. are dark. <laughs> Next week they won't be. Uh, okay, let's let's move on, babe. Sorry, this, I had to it, talk about my roots. The show is starting to fart. It's getting um, tired of us not segueing into the next part. Okay, segue. <laughs> okay, segue. All right, so they were on the World Europa. They not were Europa on Village. The MSC World, World Europa. Europa. I got told not to uh. film, but they got refunded. And real quick, they were in a. <laughs> <sighs> Where were they? You want it? <laughs> They were in a yacht club suite. They were in a yacht club suite, guys. <clears throat> Those things are a grip. So let's do a round table with the beaches. I wonder if they got it for free or did they pay? They they paid, but they got their money back. Just like they do on all their cruises. They, they actually pay to go on the cruises so that um, it's not like they're biased. Like, they have to say that this is an amazing cruise ship just because, you know, they're kind of sponsored. Okay, the Gilbs want to know what happened with Ben and David. <laughs> question mark, question mark, Betsy, quit messing up. Okay, well, almost everybody knows, but those of you guys who haven't heard, they were told to shut down their cameras on the MSC World Europa when they were filming in the Yacht Club, uh, like, suites kind of private area. Um Management came up to them and told them that some of the guests didn't like their camera, so they had to shut it down, and they were not allowed to record for the remainder of their cruise, which is kind of awful. Like, Why the they whole asked, cruise? "Can can we bring out our cell phone and record like how everybody else does?" They said, "No." Gil can we said, use, "Just kidding. Stop, Mike." Can we use our camera? No. All right. Well, round table then. How much did their suite cost? In general. In okay, general. guys, I don't know how exactly. much do you think, without Googling Billy, how much do you think a Yacht Club suite costs? Now My they got the. there's a low end and a high end. They got the low end, because I saw pictures of the high end. Oh. All right, we got 4,000. Lovey's, Lovey's coming in. Lovey's, Lovey's coming, coming in. <laughs> Quite accurate. I'm sure, pretty shocked pretty, he didn't put a 99 cents at the end of you that. You know, Mike Lovelace loves nothing more than a price tag. <clears throat> he does. He loves to tell like his prices. probably his first chat of the show, and he's throwing out prices. No, he pr he put tight. Okay, 69.99. <clears throat> My stomach is burning. 6,500, 6K. I didn't say they stop, said about Mike, 5K. Betsy. Sorry, Gilbs, I just can't do anything right today. Okay. We watched their video, but I don't recall. 5,500, 6,900. 5,480 to be exact. Was Thanks, it on Mike. sale? Don't know. Don't know. That's expensive. That's expensive for MSC as well. Because MSC, Mark can attest, you can go on an MSC cruise for fairly cheap if you do the... The, um, uh, I forget what it's called. Now, I looked up the first available sailing. Um, they do have sailings that are going out like this week, next week, but they're they're all sold out. But the next one that you can purchase is in November, uh, and it was 5200 So you guys guessed pretty close there. Can you stop yawning? I, I, can't, I literally can't. I think I'm low on oxygen. Do you need some pizza cocktail? <laughs> <laughs> I downed mine pretty much. But that's, uh, I mean, I think that's a lot of money, but it's pretty cheap for a suite, right? I mean, that's like the same price as, uh, and that's for two people, by the way. That's like the same price as like a three-day Disney cruise. That's like um, an aft balcony on um, an Alaska cruise on Norwegian. We and by the way, that. that price is for a seven-day cruise. Whoa. Hello, everyone. Hi, Sherry. I don't think that's that much. I've spent way more. Icon costs more than that for a guarantee. No, Icon costs about that for a guarantee. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah. yeah, I think that's a pretty dang good price. Maybe it went down because of... No, but they had the same price, I think. Can you do me a favor? My ADHD is bad tonight. Can you remove the bird mm -hmm. in the background of the photo? You just keep your hand right there, babe. There you the go, Larry. Show. The whole show. <clears throat> you know, it's really windy in Southern California today. It's so windy. This yeah, is actually a live feed right now. The bird's just... Flying. Stuck there. Just stuck right No, there. I watched a bird fly by earlier, and it was a crow, actually. And I was thinking to myself, why is he flapping? He literally doesn't need to flap. He could just have his wings out and just go, because the wind was <laughs> insane. But he was like this. Yeah. So maybe I don't know how to fly, so I should probably shut up. All right, Beaches. Uh, so we actually were... My, a lovey's fat <laughs> wife said there was an espresso, espresso machine, machine in the room. 
I can't speak. Can you say espresso machine? Espresso machine. Huh. Espresso, espresso, espresso. There was fruit in a bowl, not on a plate. That's worth $5,400 if you ask me. Yeah. Fancy. Okay, so we were caught on Ben and David's video, um, and we'll just kind of... Uh, we'll show the intro. Today, we are going to be taking you on a full ship tour of Royal surprise, Caribbean's surprise, icon really of the sweet. seas, the biggest ship in the world, and to the most anticipated. Uh, yeah, so we were on, you guys know, they were on Icon of the Seas. Mark we were and on Stephanie icon were, I don't, I'm surprised they weren't in their video a thousand times in the same locations we were. And we saw them, I mean, they're really nice guys and all. They're super nice. But they did not get our permission. Now, here is one of our favorite bars on the Beaches, Oasis class city. ships, and it has been brought over to the Icon. Can't it's the it. Trellis Bar, and this one is actually Who's much bigger than you find on the girl. other ships. It's the a lovely venue, really and it's really popular on an evening for an evening <laughs> cocktail before Betsy. dinner. Huh. Now, yeah, that they, they were there, and they're we super tall. He, the, the, <clears> the main the guy that has the camera and the, the amazing stability, ben. is super tall. Stability man, we'll call him. He's absolutely, he says absolutely a lot. I love the way he says. Lies. Ab absolutely. Full of lies. Whilst we were recording. Whilst. <clears throat> and then uh, again, uh, now this one we I wish. We didn't give our permission. This we're one they should have the cut out. Bar, which is now it looks like we're lush. We just, and another we just drink all over the ship. That you we find did. on Royal Caribbean <laughs> ships. Again, this is really open plan, so you do get quite a bit of music spill from the other venues. Another disappointing part of this area as well, well as how David small it is. It's a really part. small venue He's for such a popular space, and there's not much seating. Now look at, well, it's obviously the same day. It's obviously the same day, because they're in the same green dress. Before they started. Oh, yeah, man. so this is like the overhang of the Royal Promenade. We don't there know we why are they again. just didn't make this But that was the set. That we, we the were Royal in there three Promenade. times because cause he did see, a video shot going this here. way uh, in the trellis bar, and we were in that too. Yep. Again, no permission given. Do they use the big camera <clears throat> like Mike are? <clears throat> Mike yes. doesn't have a big camera. Uh, their camera was bigger than ours. Oh, I know, but you don't have a big camera. Mark has a big camera compared to you. No, this is about the same size. He just has a different handle. He has like that that angled handle. LOL, well, no, you all had to be in on that. What are the chances? We thought it was funny because we didn't know. We were ahead of them in our in our bar call to uh, to dinner. Were we going to dinner that night? Ben, ben Tall, David Bald. <laughs> <laughs> David's the one talking, I think. Uh, they both talk. Size matters, guys. Size okay. matters. A show about size. Do we have a long stick? Do you have a long stick also? That's Mark. Mark's got the long stick. Right, Mark? All right. At this point, Betsy is going to drink Wait, the rest. Wait, Captain Billy J wants to know when is our clip, video clip on the MTV show? Don't know. Haven't heard from them. We haven't heard from them. Thanks, Spider-Man. Pizza time. It's pizza time, baby. Chug that drink. <laughs> <laughs> you go ahead and chug the rest. I you want me to? so bad oh yours had more simple syrup it's not as bad ew yours was worse <laughs> yes <laughs> all right guys weird pizzas pizza? Pizza? this is a uh, part of the show where we go over weird pizzas and you guys tell us would you eat them that's, and let's give it a rating if that 10. was frozen and turkey pepperoni that's probably where we went wrong <laughs> who's turkey pepperoni it wasn't real pepperoni oh yeah maybe you should have saved the last chug for like during this because then it'll be like you're that looks seen. like a delightful pizza but also a cardiac arrest at the same time oh uh, yeah so a bunch of no's and yeses it's too big uh you know what it's the guy who returns his pizza says i asked for extra pepperoni what um, the hell is wrong my with you pepperoni's guys? burnt and you return with this can you imagine the grease from the paper towel that they blotted on the top? They didn't use a paper towel, baby. All the grease is like a pool in there. Well, Tanya says, no, ma'am. Richard says, yes. Meat lovers is right. Meat lovers. Mark says, I would eat that one pepperoni at a time. I would eat that top layer for sure yeah. one pepperoni at a time. Now that is a charcuterie board. That's a charcuterie board. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'd like a charcuterie board. I'll bring the charcuterie board. All right. My uh, acid reflux one, one and cholesterol 
are skyrocketing just looking at the picture. Poor crazy cat traveler. She's going to go back to her doctor, and her doctor's not going to let her have cheese. More cheese. All right. I give it a five. I give it a... I'd try it. I'd try it. I'd give it a five. I don't know if I could... My mouth's pretty big, but... Well, I mean, you probably have to, like, chunks of pepperonis. I would have to hit it with the fork. That's too much pepperonis, though. Okay. CCT... Crazy cat trap. McDonald's pizza. So this covers me and you because I like the nugs and you like the cheeseburgers. And we both like the fries. Yeah. Okay, I'll try it. Let's try it tonight. Does it have uh, extra yeah. cheese? Oh, yeah. So this is it cooked. Ten. <laughs> you got to put the mozzarella <laughs> cheese and bake it, right? Oh, absolutely. I was going to say the dough looks crusty. I mean, yeah. So that's the raw version. There Yum. we go. Yum. Yeah, okay. Gil say, a, yep. Uh, I'll give it a Cruise six. Cruise World says nuggies. <laughs> Lovey says disgusting. Disgust. Says the guy who shared a video of somebody posing off uh, Chef Boyardee ravioli. That is true, Mike Lovely. So you do do that. <laughs> McDonald's uh, does good fries. They do have the best <clears throat> fries. Uh, Amanda Roman says no, no, no. Test uh, Cindy again, no. says I'll eat the fries part. That's probably bomb fries baked on a pizza with cheese. I'll eat the burger part. Yeah. Slice me up. Corn dog pizza? I'll Corn eat it. Corn dog pizza? I'd eat it. You know? doesn't look terrible after leaving the club. <laughs> That's what Eric says. Eric, are you, did they approve your time off? I want to know. You know, featured on the new Carnival Late Night Buffet, Corn Dog Pizzas. This is actually from the new Carnival Guess update. Guess what? We would eat it. We probably would. <laughs> I want a corn dog pizza, man, not a crotch gobble. You know what would be the best is if it's like those AM, PM, those gas station the corn dogs. The crispy ones. No, the gas station ones that have like the jalapeno cheddar in them. Yeah, like a cheddar worst. Yeah. Uh, corn dog, no. Okay, you draw your line at corn dogs. <laughs> <laughs> but you'll have the McDonald's one. Tom says he's laughing his corn dog off. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, who doesn't want a wiener in their mouth? Obviously you do, Billy. Okay, uh, four out of ten. I'd try it. I'd try it. Drunk Betsy definitely would. No. Okay. <laughs> this is Mike Lovelace's baked. This is Mike Lovelace's This was right here. baked on a Rectech 795. Yeah, there he is right there. Margaritaville. Margaritaville. Yeah, Margaritaville. Yeah. Margaritaville. You know, is this is a Dominican pizza. Margaritaville. Two margaritas. Margaritaville. Margaritaville. That looks, not, not oh, Dominican. no, a Dominican <clears throat> means the, the resort. The wiener one, the wiener one yeah. That's, that's funny. the one they had the hot dogs on. That's so funny. It's, if your mental health is, it's for your mental health test. Uh, you know what this one will give you after you eat it? The troops. Yeah. All right. So if you were forced to eat one slice of this, which slice would you pick? The ham, the meat slice, or the mushroom, the sausage, or the... the mushroom and the egg, the tomato, or the baked beans? I would eat the mushroom and the tomato and the meat. Are the beans cooked? We don't know. No, we they are because the pizza's raw right now, but it will be cooked when it comes out of that um, oven. I think that it's cooked. The pizza looks cooked, babe. The cheese is melted. Um, Mike Lovelace says he would like the sausage in his mouth. <laughs> he said that? Yeah, see? W wow. I want the sausage in my mouth. Jeez, okay. Okay, Mike, calm down. Billy's on his way over. Lovelace is here. He wants that sausage pizza. Turk. <laughs> okay, um... One out of ten. Wouldn't try. The egg will be cooked as soon as they throw that thing all the way in the oven. It's not in the oven yet. No. All right. The baked beans were not enough on that one. Absolutely and not. you got to have egg on every piece. Why would, you have, why, would, <laughs> why would you put egg on top of baked beans? Is that a thing? I don't know. Is this, is this a country thing? We're from California. We don't know. Meg said no way. Everybody's Everyone's saying, saying no. no. And okay. they're from all over. Nope. That's a no nah. with an exclamation point. Open the door. Lovey's here. <laughs> no uh, one needed yeah, that visual at no. each No, God! <laughs> Lovey no, like God, to, please, no! 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 <laughs> no! <laughs> Linda Montemayor says that looks awful. Uh, negative five out of ten. A Definitely wouldn't try. spoon, probably. I wouldn't try it. I like eggs and beans, but not together. Okay. Um, I would eat a dino nug yeah. pizza. Those Dinosaur are crispy. chicken nuggy just needs to be sliced. It's but a dino nug pizza. Obviously, this was made at home. You could tell by the shape of the pizza. Oh. Uh, uh, you know, DiGiorno's doesn't sell the dino nuggy pizza. <laughs> Can but. I ask a question or say something? Richard said, the fact that the slice is missing on that one is scary. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's, that's true. I didn't even notice. I didn't even think. <laughs> 
But then, oh. then Tom said, Awards that one, yeah. Tom said that it's a Ben and David thing. So maybe beans and eggs is like a British thing. If they, oh, if they okay. can't, if they eat that on their pizza as a choice, who really has a problem with pineapple now? Grandson would love this. If you think that pineapple's bad on a pizza, have you tried baked beans and eggs? Add a little barbecue <laughs> and jalapeno on dino. Yum. Some red yeah. onion. Yeah, I, I'm down with the barbecue on that. Yeah, barbecue yeah. for sure. Red onion. Um, seven out of ten. I'd try it. I'd try it 100. percent Beans are traditionally served with an English breakfast. <clears throat> oh. Okay. That's a uh, lobster. Lobster pizza, but you get is that you get the seaweed whole, on the edge? Get the whole main lobster on it. Don't know. Rolliver just had flashbacks to his kids screaming in high chairs. I'm sorry about that, Rolliver. Take a drink of the wine. Oh, I just some pizza oh. flavor just came back up. Yum. You got to blow it out right away. <clears throat> okay, uh, yeah, so lobster pizza. As long as the shells are off, I, you know, 7 out of 10. Literally, I try the it. shells are there. The claws there, the tails there, the eyes are there, the ears are there. I, ears? The tentacle I things. Ears. Uh, no, I mean, like, after you take them off. Uh, Michelle WPB says, yeah, for sure. Especially if it's about 1 a.m. and I'm hungry at their bar crawl. Yep, that's right. If it was a lobster tail only pizza, then yes. But a whole lobster, no. I mean, lobster mac and cheese is good. So That's it... my thought. Lobster mac and cheese is good. Yeah, so, so why not? I'll eat it. Okay, as long as uh, we remove the shells first, I'm down. Seven lobster out of ten. covers it. not included. What about a bib? <gasps> Ooh, what about mm. the rest of the seafood? Well, why do they have the tails on, on the shrimp? Uh, you know, because you got to remove the tail. And clams and mussels. Mus no. And octopus and tentacles. Octopus, I'm out. That's like Devin's pizza right there. Yeah. Absolutely not. Uh, I mean, I'd try like like a really thin slice. And that'd be it. Yeah. Nope. I don't want that I might all. actually pick the shrimps off. I would pick the shrimp off, eat I'm the shrimp, and I'm not down for the mussels. There's calamari <laughs> as well. I could see the rings. Okay, Mark, maybe, maybe this the, is an um, exotic pizza. Maybe the tentacles are calamari too then. It's just the tentacle pieces. No, it looks like... Like uh, octopus? Yeah. Um, uh-uh. Three out of ten. I like this. Uh-uh. I, I, I would barely try it. I'd take this a bite. This one made me unhungry. I agree, <laughs> mate. Octopi? It, I'm oh, out too, you Betsy. You know, if that wasn't enough seafood for you, go for this one. You know, you got the... Oh, just a full... Yeah, you got some chum in there. No. Okay, what are we... If, Living in a pineapple under the sea? I don't think so. <laughs> it's chum bucket. But there it's is some last... arugula on there, so they're going somewhere. Yeah, yeah you. You like know, it. I love me some arugula. Can I tell you a funny story about arugula? I'm literally talking to Rachel about um, Carnival Cruise, teaching our coworker about cruising before we get on our cruise. I said there's late night pizza, and my friends like to make fun of me because I like the pizza that has the arugula on it. Not two minutes later, does. Donna texts me a picture of, of, arugula. A, of arugula and says, Kaylee doesn't want the rest of her arugula. Do you want it? And I said, see? See, Rachel? <laughs> Mike will eat anything if Eric Wilson gives it to him. No, I, not this. Nope, not this. Yeah, drunk Mike might. Stinky, yeah. You can Tanya, smell Tanya, this picture. Tanya, do you think drunk Mike would eat that? Chum bucket is It's right. basically anchovy but fresh, not out of a can. Uh, those are not anchovies. Those are, um... I don't know what they are, but... Pizza for yeah. your fishing drip. Uh, negative 10, and I would not try it. Uh, uh, now, this one looks like it has bugs on it. No, it's seaweed. Uh, there's legs and heads on those things. Ew, I'm out. What is it, beetles and mushrooms? I don't know what it is. This well, is like a pizza off, in India or something? That's disgusting. And <clears throat> I'm out. Oh, uh, sardines those... was the last one. Sardines. Mackerel, maybe mackerel. Who knows? Uh, yeah, so that's... And they're not even cooked yet, either. Crickets. So nope. the bugs have to be Drunk cooked? Drunk Mike may eat a chicken wing off the floor. Positive vibes, Danny said. See, look at this guy over here, babe. You can see his legs clearly babe, on the Babe, I don't want... Is it frogs? No, those are insects. I'll feed Lovey a slice. Wow. Billy. Breaking news. Sal Patera has officially gave up on his exclusive carnival influencer status and will now... And we'll cruise other cruise lines. But what I really <laughs> want to know is, will Josh and Michelle help? Oh, him? also breaking news. Lovey at the Lovey end of his show said, said he's he, booking Royal. He said Royal is next on his bucket list. It's high. It's on the top of the ladder there. 
Let me know when uh, and I'll okay, go. This one... Go on Star of the Seas with me and Mike. November 2nd, 2025. Uh, negative 100. We'll never try. I'll never try that. Hot Cheetos pizza. I don't like Hot Cheetos. Sloan would love that, though. Now, Lovey said Josh uh... and Michelle are taking over for Sal. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, oh, man. It's the best thing I heard all night. <laughs> oh, man. Virgin is next on my list of new cruise oh. lines. Me too. I want to try Virgin. But no, I wouldn't eat yeah. that, but Sloan would love it. I bet Sloan would love that. Same test. Uh, I'd try it. I mean, I would have... No, I don't like the taste of those I would things. have like two bites. Three out of ten. I'd take a bite of that if no one was looking. But look at the paper. This, I think, is an actual, an actual pizza place. Because it's a pizza place. Looks like sea- ooh Nutella. Uh, Nutella. Now the crust looks kind of weird. It's too not cooked enough. They needed yeah. a. They either need to proof their dough longer, or they put like powdered sugar just, in their crust or something. No, it's it's not cooked enough, or they didn't proof the dough long enough, um, or as my brother would say, retard the dough. <laughs> <laughs> Mike and I, Mike and I had a, a pizza restaurant for a little while. <laughs> And you have to let pizza dough he sit for two. Proof the dough was the same thing as retard the dough. Okay, so <laughs> you have to when you make fresh dough, you have to let it sit for two days before you can use it. It's got to proof. Well, if you he use it too, some... if you use it too quick, it's flat and turns really white. If not, if you let it proof, or as my brother says, retard the dough, <laughs> it gets poofy and golden. He had some mean coworkers. That's what happened. What? That's what happened. They, oh, they taught him that. They told my brother might be special. Um, eight out of ten, I would definitely. Eat I would that. eat that. Put me probably, some straws and some bananas slices. on it. Done. Uh, now you've heard of ham and pineapple. What about kiwi and pineapple? I would try it, kiwi but I would ham. want my kiwi sliced up a little bit more. Ferment the dough. I don't, know, I don't dough. know about that one. It's just know. like pineapple. It has that same citrusy vibe. I guess so. Okay, I'd we try would try it. Mike. You would try the fish one, but you wouldn't. And the hot cheeto one, but you won't try this. I would try it. I just said I'd but, try it. But I'd try it. If I didn't like it, I would take the kiwis off and eat the pizza, and it probably have still have a good like residual flavor. Okay, we are getting close to the hour, so we gotta fly through these. Um, Pickle, dill, and is, is that and like sour cream on it's it? It's probably um t- t- tzatziki sauce and dill. So you gotta have that extra pickly flavor. No, with dill sprinkled on Absolutely it. Absolutely not. We hate that. Skip. Uh, zero out of ten. Oh, Meg says, Meg says yes. yes. Spaghetti pizza? Spaghetti pizza? I'd try it. I mean, it's not necessary. I mean, the crust Gilles is already would eat carbs. it. Richard would eat it. Cheryl one day down would eat it. Pass, Pass on, the, on pickle. the pickle, yeah. They would try. Ooh, a Oh, you're really pizza. keeping your wrench today, Captain Billy. The Gilds uh, love pickles. No. No. Would not. Uh, this one, yes, I would try this one. Not necessary, but I would try it. Um, five out of ten. Sushi pizza? Mark, exotic. It's already, it's already, Take the roll. It's already cooked and, they, and the pizza got cold and then they just put the sushi on top. Roll it. You have the, But the thing is you roll your pizza slice around the sushi and you, can, and you take a bite. And but, it's like a sushi. And also the type of sushi you could tell was like from the grocery from store. From the grocery store for sure. Um, like it came out of some plastic packaging. Yeah, I wonder if this is what cruising you know? for food is having. To, not cruising for food. Um, cocktails and cruising. It is it is sushi night. And it's uh, pie day. So if it was is... in a taco, cruising for food would have it. Cruising for food's about to be on a cruise in two days. No uh, hot pizza with cold sushi. Nah, taco time. I, I'd try it. Six out of ten. Okay. All right, last one. That <laughs> <laughs> looks disturbing. <laughs> That's disturbing. Richard Carrier says gas station sushi. Um, ten out of ten. No. Try, try it for sure. I would not. You're Just choking the, on a wiener right the down your throat. Novelty of it. You know, if it was a pretzel bun, I'd be in, but no pretzel bun, is. I'm out. It's, it's not it's a pretzel pre- bun, you can tell. Pretzel, it's a little pretzel. It's shiny. No. Yes, every single wiener. Billy needs some action. <laughs> All right, guys, there it was. There it was. There it was. Get to the cruise quick. All right, let's get to the game quick, guys. I mean the, the cruise. <clears throat> get to the cruise. I would like to be on vacation after my stressful week. Uh, Kahoot, you know how it is. Type in your... Quickly. Game pin, 831-4756. Oh, you're going to go pee break, I'm Betsy, on me? I'm going to do a quick nose blow. Okay. Well, I got to find pee break, Betsy, then. Ah! Gee, why did you have to yell, ah! like, twice? I unplugged you and not me. Because my knee, Mike, is my knee. Man. 
Messy Tessie is here. Jim is here. Ah! <clears throat> oh, there's P. Break Betsy. Right when you got back. Oh, you're back. Mike, get that bitch out of here. Body God, gamer, smiling zebra, was Michelle so WPB. Disgusting with the smiling zebra, DJ controversy. Ziggy, cheesehead. Uh, Dranty Dairy, is that how you say good it? Good night, Finding Miriam. Good night, good night, Finding Miriam. Thanks for joining us. Ig Dr. Eight Exotic Anti Dairy. G H. Pay attention to the whole show. It's Dr. Anti Dairy. Doctor anti dairy. Yeah, <clears throat> C crazy cat traveler has a doctor that has two points because she won't let her eat doc gravy. I mean, dairy. Oh. Pay, pay attention to the whole show. All right, we got fourteen in here. We got fifteen in here. We will give it one more minute because we're running out of time. We want we might take this show till seven o five, babe. <sighs> till seven o five. Messy Tessie. <clears throat> you know that was a good show. Do you think they'll play reruns of Messy Bessie no, Higginbottom? No, I look for that on YouTube. I want to. I want to. Watch that show so bad. I love that show. Mighty what was B. it called? Mighty B. Bessie Higginbottom. By um, what's her Messi. what's her name from Parks and Rec? She was the voice. The blonde lady. Yeah. Mm. Leslie Nope Leslie was her character nope. name, but what's her name in real life? I don't know. Rolliver is here. Okay, we can quit now. Rolliver's here. Ooh, we got nineteen. Re Regina Falange. There's Phoebe Falange. God, there's a lot of the Falange oh, family. Oh, someone just dropped out. They must be changing their name or they lost connection. Exotic Eater. I wonder who that is. That's Mark. All right, guys. This game was created by none other than ChatGPT. It is a funny game. So you're not going to really know the answers. The answers are based on what ChatGPT thinks the answers are. So, um, Billy J, you cannot Google what you think the answers are. Yeah, Billy. Uh, because it could be anything. You never know. So Woo! here we go. We're going to start in three, oh. Elated two, turtle is back. one. Let's go. Mm, Kahoot. It's 7.55. It's already 9.52 High day pizza here. quiz. We're going to run through these as fast as we can, babe. You can't go to 7.55. It's already 9.52. Sorry, Ann. It's uh, If pizza was an actor, who would it be? All right. This one has a whole minute because there's a lot of reading. Benedict Cumberbatch because it's sophisticated and versatile. Ryan Reynolds, because it's cheesy, but in a good way. Dwayne The Rock Johnson, because it's everyone's favorite heavyweight. Or Scarlett Johansson, because it looks good from any angle. The green one. All right. Oh, there we go. All answers are in. Ryan, Ryan Reynolds, Reynolds is correct. Ryan Reynolds is correct. DJ Controversy is in the lead. Exotic <laughs> Eater, <laughs> GH, General Hospital, Manatee, and Cheesehead. Let's go to question number two. GH? What did the pizza say to the delivery guy? Babe, read the, the answers. You don't pepper on me. Let's <laughs> slice this up. I'm too saucy to handle. Make sure you don't lose me in trans, trans, trans topping. I don't know how to say that word. All right, five seconds, guys. Five, four, three, two. You don't two, pepper on me. Oh, you don't pepper on me. That was my vote because that's yeah. why I said it. <clears throat> Oh, oh, Regina, Regina Falange. Falange. Uh, Exotic. Sorry, DJ down. Controversy, but you're still holding the second place. Question three. What's a pizza's favorite movie genre? Babe, read the answers. Romantic slices. Pie fi Dough comedy. Crustern. I like that. Actually. I like pie fi <laughs> Pie fi I like mm -hmm. crustern. Dough comedy. Look at that pizza Romantic. right there. That, that pizza looks like a he, nice He's really slice. liking his movie, whatever genre it is. He might be high. Hi-Fi hi -fi. is correct. Right. Oh, no. Oh, Matt 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 Come on, Mike. Wow. So this is an interesting game, how the, the leaderboard is always shifting. It's shifting because there's, no, it, yeah. there's no cheating. And notice Why Billy isn't even on here. did the pizza apply for a job? Babe? It needed the dough. <laughs> I wanted to get a slice of life. It had a lot of crust and an ambition to avoid feeling cheesy at home. <laughs> It needed um, the dough is my answer. Chat GPT made some good Chat questions, Chat GPT huh? is pretty funny. We should let him know. It, it needed, needed the, the dough. dough. Yes. 
Oh, I hate it when we're late. Just assume we got here in the first few, right? Oh, exactly. Oh, that's okay. You guys have been here the whole time, right? You guys are yeah, here. You didn't I, I thought we said hi to you. Uh, yeah, about we did. said hi right in the beginning. 55 minutes ago. Matinee uh, holds on to the top. Regina climbs back up to fourth, and so does A.A. Ron in fifth. <laughs> Question five. How Tom, does a pizza flirt? Are you topping? Because I can't go out without you. <laughs> Do you believe in love at first slice? That's how Mark got Stephanie. Mm. It's hot in here, or is it just my oven? I must be a pizza because I can't be. On, I can't wait to be cheesy with you. How do you get a play, bass player off your porch? <laughs> oh. Do you believe in love at first slide? Was the correct That's answer. The best answer according to Chat GPT. Chat GPT says. Uh, let's see. Matinee holds on to the first spot. Okay. DJ controversy jumps up. Real Captain They're Billy jumps up. They're trying to get their shirt for the non for the non inaugural. Yeah. What Question do you six. call a sleeping pizza? Is it a a restaurant? <laughs> a pie yawny? A do a dozer? A doza? A snoozerella. Mm, restaroni mm. is my favorite. Mm. I'm just going to take a little restaurant. That guy didn't even eat his pizza yet. He's taking a weed nap, babe. Oh, he was definitely high. Uh, the uh, snoozerella is correct. Oh. Although I do like restaurant. Rest, like I'm going to rest, use restaurant probably for the rest of my life. DJ <gasps> Controversy. Whoa! Question seven. Why did the pizza go to therapy? It had too much baggage from its toppings. <laughs> That's funny. It couldn't deal with being cut into pieces. It felt like life was going in circles. Its life was going in circles. It felt too crusty and burned out. Oof. That's me, crusty and burned out. Yeah. You see the pizza there talking to the therapist, babe? Bye, Tess. Bye, Tess. Thanks for joining us. Bye, Tess. I hope you're not pissed off that we're doing this cruise. Or this. How many peeps are in here, even? <clears throat> Uh, I feel like life was going in circles, babe. Oh, that's not the best answer. Uh, Zodic Eater up too. It's holding on to that first spot. DJ. Be Question safe, Tess. Be safe. What's a pizza? What's a pizza maker's favorite song? Rolling in the deep dish by Adele. Cheesy like Sunday morning. Slice, slice, baby. Don't stop <laughs> believing. <laughs> Did I do it good? Yeah. Good job, babe. 17 <laughs> answers in, 18 <laughs> answers in. Someone like, throw in that last answer. That pizza slice looks like you when you're editing a video and you're ready to go to bed. He's jamming out, babe. Who can just sit there and listen to music and slice, just chill? Slice, slice, baby. Bum, 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 He's sitting on his beanbag. Yes, my jam. Oh, DJ Controversy is on fire. Highest answer streak of five. Whoa. All right, question number nine. Got two more to go. What's a pizza's life philosophy? You are what you eat, so be delicious. This is a working out slice. Life's not about finding yourself. It's about finding the perfect topping. In crust, we trust. <laughs> a slice a day keeps the sadness away. I'm with that one. But I like in crust, we trust. Do you like in crust, we trust? Yeah. In crust, we trust. Yes. In crust, we trust. Hey, Aaron Smith, did you get that intellectual integrity that you needed earlier? <clears throat> Int intellectual stimulation? Yeah. This guy's working out. Okay, I think we got all the answers. Now. I'm going to skip. In crust, we, we trust. trust. Two people got it right. It's, uh, let's Three see. people, because I voted that, too. DJ, DJ, holds on to the top spot. Nobody's, nobody's score has changed there. So the two people that got it right, up five places, is Beetle Pie. Billy, you're not a real captain just because you capitalize real. Question 10. How do you fix a broken pizza? <laughs> Some with tomato, tomato paste? paste? With cheese glue? With a pizza patch? Yeah, just see the evidence and order a new one. I like number three or yeah. number four. I like that one, huh? All right, well, let's see. 17 answers in. One more, one more, Remember one more. Remember that disgusting pizza 18 cocktail? answers in. You just eat the evidence and order, order a new, new one. one, just like our drink. Just like I said. Dun, 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 dun. Third place mm -hmm. is real Captain Billy J. Captain Billy J. DJ Controversy. Wait, wasn't DJ in first? No, no, no. Exotic here. DJ Controversy. Boop, 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 boop. 
was beat out by Exotic Eater at the last minute. DJ Controversy, well played game. Exotic Eater, congratulations. Exotic Let us Eater, know who you what are. shirt do you want? Do you want, do you the, want uh, the nobody has to know shirt? Or would you like the late night pizza shirt? Yeah, please let, let Mike us know. know. Um, who is G H? General, uh, General Hospital. Hospital. That's, Carla, that's McClendon. Carla McClendon. Fake Captain. Okay, who is Exotic? Congratulations, Exotic. We need to know who Exotic was Who's before the show exotic? ends. Hurry! Good grief, I got two correct. Oh, thank you so man. much for being here. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, Good thank try, you, thank you. Good try, controversial. You were so close. You guys are awesome. We love all of you so, 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 so much, and we couldn't do this show without you. Each and every single one of you are important, and we appreciate you dedicating one hour plus a premiere to your Thursday. Yes. Say good night. Good night, beaches. We will see you in just a couple minutes. And then after that, we'll see you next week. Bye, beaches.